Today's pedicure client came from out of state to get the help she needs with her nails. She has seen podiatrists as you can see the scars on her toes from procedures. I hope watching this toenail transformation inspires techs all over the world to get the additional education from my online nail academy to help people who need it most and join my meticulous manicurist network. You are going to see a huge transformation with lots of compacted buildup removal, aesthetic contouring, and more. So stay tuned. Jackson, and uh, he's been there, I think, about a year now. He just uh, finished his. Well, he's been if you're new here, welcome. Please subscribe and click the bell to turn on your notifications to know when I upload my weekly video and be notified if your comment got the most likes and will be featured in an upcoming video. Uh, he lays out the, didn't cut the big toe very short. I like them short. And, uh, and then the other ones, I don't know whether it's just relax your toes there. They always tell me, oh, you've got a build up underneath there and I can't cut on them. Hey, but, you know. Then I see you, you know, on YouTube. Well, I'm going to thin them out. I'm going to shape them. Uh, I don't want you to wear nail polish today because you're going to be putting on a product to clear your nails up. To do what? To clear your nails oh, up. Oh, okay. Yeah, we have to get rid of all of this discoloration. Okay. And then your nail will start growing thin again. I think I'm going to have to have <clears throat> the other toenail taken off, but I just haven't done it yet, but I need to do that. Yeah, it's under there because we don't want to cut live skin. But I'd love sure. to know what city and state you are in yeah. that you wish you had a certified meticulous manicurist nail technician that you could depend on to help you with your pedicure services. Are you diabetic? If they see your comment, no. you might get one soon. You have good feeling in your feet? Mm -hmm. I just look at the doctor and my A1C was good. Just relax your foot. Now, do you round them off at the, at the edges? I do. Oh, good. starting to curve a little. Congratulations to our featured comment winner, Melissa Seely. Her comment had 371 likes on Mr. Meticulous's video where he got his nails polished. Her comment said, you married him for his deep sidewalls, <laughs> didn't you? So your drive was good? Yes, uh-huh. We got a little, a little sprinkling of one part, but then the closer we got to here, it cleared up. And <clears throat> I know our area was supposed to be uh, 
plowed it in somewhere later on in the day. <clears throat> They're not real hot today. <laughs> I know, it's fun to watch too, I love, isn't it? So, you know, have you done any lately? Oh, sure do. oh yeah, I do. surface things. So you know I've been putting on that spongy, spongy. Okay. On my toes. I didn't put any when I got out of the shower today because I knew I was coming here. And you probably I don't know. I just didn't do it. Yeah, I have a product that I want you to use that's going to add moisture to your nail plate. This toenail squeezing so hard that you've got these corrugations going yeah. down. It's like splitting your toenail. Yeah, and that's from? From dehydration from the nail fungus. Oh. And then the, pro the product will moisturize your nail plate and your nail will uh -huh. lift back up. So it doesn't squeeze. But you're gonna have a normal looking toe when you leave. Really? Yeah. Sorry. That's okay. I love your ring, but it's so pretty. Thanks. Someone must love you a lot. <laughs> <laughs> 
Someone knows I put up with a lot. Yeah, it's a two-way street, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> He's a good husband, but he can be difficult sometimes. <laughs> What? Is that half full? Yeah. I thought so. In fact, it felt like um, it's getting a little slow here where you're at now. Because I don't think that last girl I went to got it out. Yeah. Is that the dental? Uh, you're using? No. Oh. No, this is called the ingrown sidewall cleaner. Oh, okay. It's got a little scoop on the edge yes. so you can pull out mm -hmm. the buildup. Oh. This is from my brand of tools. Uh -huh. oh. All right, let's trim a little bit more. Good. <laughs> Relax your toes Once all of this buildup gets out of there, then your nail bed will go back down. Mm -hmm. And your, because your toenail is squeezing in, yes. and it's pushing, it's pinching the skin up inside there, so it's oh. making the skin go higher. So what? It's making the skin go, go higher. higher. Yeah. Oh, so okay. the nail will come out, the skin will go back down. Oh. They just don't have the education for it. That is? Yeah. But I'm trying to help them. I started an online training academy so uh -huh. they can get the education that they need so they can help more sure. people all sure. around the world. The one I run to for many years, she just said, I just don't have time to do what you need to have done. And she, she thinks that the foot doctors are going to do it. Well, they don't either. They yeah. don't do anything but just cut your nails. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're not going to do any aesthetic work. Uh -uh. And when, when people know how to do it, it really does not take that long. Really? Mm -hmm. so. I get emails and messages every day from nail technicians all around the world thanking me for the education I provide here on YouTube for free that has helped boost their career. But what I teach in my online training courses is the education you need to launch your career and provide the best services to your clients. Information you won't find anywhere else and I promise it is invaluable and you will reap the rewards by joining my network. Until my 19-year-old figures out what he wants to do, he yes. took, he's <laughs> taken some college classes, but he's taking a break right now until he figures it out. Sure no, <laughs> and he helps us. He works in the warehouse, so. Oh. He'll figure it out. That is 
just was that a graduation party in the outdoors this weekend, and my young niece's daughter graduated, and <clears throat> but she knows what she she wants to go into nursing. And, uh, but there was another young guy there, and he had no idea what he wanted to do. <laughs> I think it just takes longer for guys to figure it yeah. out. Yeah. They need to find a woman that'll tell them what to do. Yeah. That's what they need. <laughs> they think they have it all figured out, but really they don't. <laughs> what type of work does your husband do? He's a welder. Oh, he's a welder. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Another thing when you get older, you get all these spots. Okay. Oh. There's a little mole there, I think. Okay. Okay. Did you go to a school around here when you went for a uh, The school that I went to was about an hour away. Was it? Yeah. Was it every day? Yeah. And the girls on that. Yeah. I started to do my nails the other day and I just ran out of time. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sometimes I am too busy, I just can't care. <laughs> yeah, I understand. <laughs> I should do another video about like the day in the life of. You should. <laughs> and then people will be like, oh my God. Like, I'm glad I'm not her. <laughs> what time do you start? Well, I start taking clients at nine, but I get up at about six. There you go. So I can start with the online responsibilities. Wow. Emails. Or the bigger you get, the more work you have. Yeah, it, it's a whole other industry. It's crazy. Have you put any new ones on lately? Mm -hmm. Have you? Yeah, every Friday. Oh, every Friday? Oh, yeah. I'll have to make sure I do that. Um, well, there's a, a nice little diner just right next door that has like home cooked meals and okay. stuff. Uh -huh. Yeah. Just relax your toes.
get a chance to go out for dinner at all? Bruce and I try to go to dinner like once a week. Do ya? Yeah, we have date night on Fridays. Oh, good. I go out that night too with my other little friends. That's good. You guys have a little club. Yeah. Keep each other company. That's we good. also, from our church, we have, um, we celebrate birthdays. And then whoever's birthday it is, they choose where they want to go. And we all go. That's nice. And we just give cards <laughs> and pay for their dinner. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, I'm the one calling everyone. That's right, I have. Eight of them, oh, there's ten of us, or eleven. Yeah. Get told that you said it's blues. Mm -hmm. um, when I uh, walk, it's uh, goes underneath the pole. Oh. Not all the way, but yeah. you know. Where do you like to go when you go out? We go to the right. Celine Inn, yep, right there. Celine or to a little Mexican place down the street called uh -huh. Miserape. Mm -hmm. There's sometimes the, the little uh, mom and pop places are the best. <laughs> yep, they are what keep America going. That's right. do our best to support our local places. Yeah. yeah I do too. And when we go to South Bend, we have a bigger uh, selection of I have three dogs. Three dogs. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The oldest is 13. He's a mix between a Jack Russell Terrier and a Pit Bull, and his name's Buddy. Mm -hmm. And then I have a mini Labradoodle named Lacey, and she's black. And then I have a seven year old mix of a Chihuahua and a Lab. Oh, and wow. her name is Maya. Maya. <laughs> yes. We got her in Cancun. Where? <laughs> in Cancun. Oh, did you? Yeah. On vacation eight years ago. Aww. Yeah. My pretty, uh, I have, I don't know if you want to do that now. I got her in 2008.
falling out, hitting some kind of a Trip you. She is so far away from you whenever you're walking. I don't know if the people that might have had her, she was, that thought she was maybe a year old when I took her for the first time. And uh, so, uh, anyway, she, she is a sweet as little thing. She doesn't bite, she doesn't pounce at you. She, Oh. She'll get she loves her little love on her, you know, and in the evening or if I'm sitting in my chair, she'll if she's not sleeping, she'll come up and she comes on my chest. And you know how kitties go like that. Yeah, they need your they need, yeah. Skin. And and, uh, and then and then I uh, of course uh, tickle her around her neck and her little face and if I stop she takes her little paw. <laughs> so I like, wait a minute, you're not done. Keep going. <laughs> and then too, uh, when at night when we're sleeping, she has to be right up against me. And her body heat. <laughs> yeah. And she will uh, put her little paws on my arm, you know, or are on my face and that's just too beautiful. She wasn't inside outside kitty when I first got her, but with moving and everything, she, um, so this friend of mine took care of her to my house, was renovated, and uh, she was kept inside because she didn't want her to run away, and I didn't either. <laughs> And now she doesn't even want to go out. She wants to go just outside the door on my the before and after photos are coming right up and don't forget to watch the video of the right foot. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to visit my channel. People like you are the reason for my success and I appreciate it so much. But remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for all the latest videos. Remember it is free and I'll see you next time.